New Yorkers will understand when we say we're making chicken riggies. Question is, do you know what chicken riggies is? Or are? Chicken riggies. Everybody knows what it is. It's chicken rigatoni. That's the riggy part. And it's a saucy and it's spicy and it's delicious. And they use those hot cherry peppers that you just can't freaking get here on the West Coast. So we're going to fake it with some other shit. But it's going to be good. And it's going to be hearty. And it's perfect for this time of year. Perfect for this terrible freezing cold weather that we have in San Diego. What is it? Probably like 60, 59 or something today. We just can't take it anymore. We can't. By the way, like the shirt? It comes with chance pre-scratched off because nobody, nobody's ever going to say f chance. It's a good one. I like that. This. Available now. Shop stcg.com. Shop stcg.com for all your F Max apparel. We could have a whole line. The kid is such a good sport too. He loves it. All right. This is about 40 minutes to start to finish. So if we don't start, we can't finish. I got a hot cast iron pan. Sorry. I got a hot cast iron pan right here. And in it, we'll go a couple pounds of chicken thighs cut up and seasoned with salt and pepper. And I'll do this in two batches so I don't drive the temperature of the pan down too fast. Do about one pound, get it nicely browned all the way around. Take it out, put the other pound in, finish it off. Chances are growing, boy, we need to be able to send a lot home with him and you. And it's chicken, and it's pasta, and everybody likes chicken and pasta. Okay, when you get your chicken done, and by the way, we're not trying to cook it all the way through. That will happen in the sauce. Just a little color on the outside is fine. Now, right in, we'll go some yellow onion and some red pepper. Get these guys softened up for a couple minutes. Okay, these guys are soft. Now I'm going to add some of this kind of chili pepper that I've chopped up. There's about seven, eight in here, and they will go. And this was one serrano. And you know it's hotter than a jalapeno. Dice that up, and it goes. We give this about a minute. Keep your face away from the steam because A, it will be hot, and B, it will be spicy in your nose. We go with about a half a cup of white wine, or you know me, I like vermouth. Let this simmer away for a couple minutes so it's reduced by about half. Actually, this is the perfect time to throw in about six, seven ounces of sliced mushrooms. We'll let them absorb a little bit of that vermouth deliciousness. We've now made boozy mushrooms. About a tablespoon of the garlic that I forgot. This is perfect timing for it. Give this a quick mush around. And now we'll add a cup of chicken broth, an eight ounce can of crushed tomatoes. And while we're waiting for that to simmer, let's put our chicken and the juices in. Lovely. Lovely. Oops. Oh, we got a little bag of pasta here. Oh boy. So much for that. I just realized a critical mistake I've made here. The Sam the Cooking Guy 12 inch cast iron pan holds an awful lot, but it ain't gonna hold all of this. So here's what we're gonna do. This needs to simmer for 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes. We're gonna let that happen. You see it's starting to bubble. But when you see it again, it's gonna be in a bigger pot to accommodate my f up. So look how beautiful. And see how nicely it fits in a much larger pot? I got carried away with myself. I do love the cooking guy cast iron pan and I try and use it as often as possible, but. So now we add a couple of things. Wait for the fucking plan. First in, about a quarter cup of butter. This is richening. Next, cup of heavy cream. That's for thickening. And last but not least, almost, about a half a cup Parmesan cheese. This is for deliciousing. It's like Italian butter chicken. It's gorgeous. Over the next three, four minutes, we let this thicken. Then we add our rigatoni. Because all we got now is chicken. We ain't got no riggies yet. It's rigatoni time. And in we come with our Asian spider. One pound of rigatoni. If you didn't use rigatoni, you could use something else, but then you can't call it chicken riggies. Chicken fettuccines doesn't sound the same. There's a little panache to the riggies. But what about the chicken piggies that you emailed me this morning we were doing? It was a mistake. I wonder what chicken piggies would be. And I've cooked these, it'd be chicken sausage wrapped in puff pastry. I've cooked this rigatoni about uh, two minutes less than the box calls for, as we'll let it finish cooking right here. And we mix, look at this. Oh, mama, marron. So you wanna make sure that the gorgeous sauce is now covering up the rigatoni so it can finish its cooking. Mama. 
beautiful. See how beautifully rich this has gotten? That, ladies and gentlemen, is what a little thyme, a little cream, and a little cheese will do. But now I can kill this heat, and let's just have a little bit. Oh boy. So to this, I must add some parm and do that. Wow. Damn. Damn is right. Damn hell and damn. It smells so good too. Let's eat. So the key, if it wasn't obvious, to get some chicken and a riggy at the same time in the same bite. And hey, if you can get some vegetable too, then do it. But you get the high points. Mm. There's a little afterglow of heat in my mouth, which is fantastic. You want to put more uh, peppers in, you put more peppers in. For me, I think that was nice. I know I generally try and uh, shoot at the middle of the room. I don't shoot, I aim for the middle of the room. I don't aim. I, I try not to make things too spicy, and this is, this is it's almost perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So give it a whirl. I think the New Yorkers will be happy that they've made an impact on you a life. And you enjoy things like this. You fucking tool. Why'd I have to throw that in? That was not necessary to anything. What is necessary is that you hit the subscribe button and love us. I wish you could change the like button to love because sometimes I want to love a site so much that like isn't enough. But if you do need more after subscribing, you could go to shopstcg.com and get a fuck Mac shirt or a pan or a knife or some BFF.